some fancy cues. Jarvan is a lot more telegraphed, yeah. so it'll be easier to play against, but yeah. We're heading to the rift? We are heading to the rift, and it's the second game here in the summer split. You guys know what to do. There are the team comps on your screens. Hop onto Twitter, hashtag G-I-A-Win, or hashtag C-W-Win. Let us know who you think is going to win. What do you think, Trev? Who's going to take this one? I don't know, Krepo. You've, you know, you've built up a lot of expectation on the Copenhagen Wolves' shoulders. To play with, considering that Nautilus, Urquhart, Kragas, Rumble are all going to be marginally ahead of him. But for the CS advantage Pepinero has built up, Audrey is falling behind. That lane swap going early. Soren takes two shots from Pepinero's ultimate, but both low on mana, even eats the Arcano Pulse. Frederick does have flash available. He he wanted, he wanted to it have badly. a piece of pigeon pie, but he decided against it. We're looking at a dive, teleports are up though. They might come in here. Well, Fnatic, be a party. Fnatic made the tower dive work yesterday against Unicorns of Love. Airwax, he gets the body slam into Audrey as Audrey's hopping away. Now Airwax in trouble. First blood goes to Audrey after a Ren stacks get popped. Whirlips teleported in, and this is so messy from the Copenhagen Wolves. Double Young kill. now in trouble. Flash is available, but where is he going to go? He's flashed over the wall. Audrey follows That's through. That's a triple. That's going to be a triple kill for Audrey. Freeze forced to flash away, and Whirlip trying to chase down. Three for one after a tower dive the Wolves initiated. 40 seconds, Giants got themselves four members in the mid lane. No teleport from Whirlip, keep that in mind, but Audrey's in trouble. He's out of position, he gets knocked towards the tower, and Frederick's pushed back as well. Soren manages to get some help on the board as Fra Awax gets the kill. Now, the Flame Spitzer from Youngbike is going to get two kills for the Copenhagen Wolves, and Giants, they just bit off more than they can chew in that middle lane. Then Giants start snowballing. Uh, Copenhagen Wolves finding themselves pushed further and further back. They have clawed back some of that gold lead. Aerox is flanking. But Soren's in a lot of trouble. Frederick gets knocked against the wall by the explosive cast. Black Shield is up, but it's Godfrey that caught by the dredge line. Soren is throwing in those sand soldiers. The slam dunk cataclysm. That's going to lock Aerox yes, in place. Audrey's trying to get away, but now he's on the front line. Freeze looking for the position reverser. He flashed over the wall. He should get Whirlip backwards. Whirlip will be going down. That's a double kill for Soren, the man who was so hurt from the CS deficit. Towers any earlier and it opens up the map way too easily, so they start to believe him. Oh, Pepe Nero, right of the Arcane. One, he's got two more shots, two misses, three flashed away. Pepe Nero really wanted that kill. Put on his dancing shoes and Pepe Nero might, yeah, he might pay for that with his oh, life. Oh, he's going to be so salty after that one because and rightfully so. threw everything at Soren, hammering away on that inner turret. As Audrey, he's now going to get caught out. Body slam connects. Audrey's going to get knocked backwards. And Airwax doesn't want too many Ren stacks, but with the assistance of Freeze and Unlimited, that's going to be a dead killer stun. Displace those sand soldiers of his. Manages to get himself out. Going on Peppy. All right, Peppy near. He's going to flash from a dredge line. You're not going to get away from that one or the depth charge either. We do see him caught out. That's a flash forward. Airwax gets knocked up. Peppy's got the black shield and somehow he's still alive. Finally gets burned down by the overheating young buck. They've traded mid laner for top laner, but Freeze, he's found Whirlip. Mega Nar is charging. It's not there. It's not enough. Acid Hunter secures the second kill of the fight for the Wolves. Frederick has been good at stealing dragons in the past, or Barons. Well, it's how they beat Elements, and we'll see if it's going to work. We do see Emperor's Divide splitting them up. Airwax flashes forward to the Body Slam. Soren throws the soldiers forward. You could call one of them Grey Worm if you like. Frederick now on the retreat. Smite is up. Those Sand Soldiers poking away. Airwax again chasing. He's got no mana, but Soren does. But his soldiers can't reach. Dragon goes back to the pit and is still alive. And Frederick is putting on a dance. Here comes Young Buck. Equalizes up. The epic chase continues. Godfred delivers a Black Shield, and Frederick takes them on a magical journey around the map. So it's a big wall, guys. He knew Gragas was there. Was his place. It's, there we go. Defensive. Acting. I like this term, acting. Did you see blue buff picked up by Pepinero in the eye of the storm? That's a flash forward, but the dredge line misses. We do see the depth charge chasing through, but Black Shield is going to negate it. No Equalizer's fine. been dropped as well. Copenhagen Wolves have chucked a whole lot of tools at the Giants because they want... Airwax the in the back. Where is Airwax? The barrel's gone out and split Giants up. They have caught Frederick in place, but he's put the Cataclysm down. Right to the Arcane goes out. They've traded Junglers one for one. Soren has knocked everybody back to the Wolves, but there's just too much damage from Pepinero. Oh. He's Freeze is alive. Through them. Freeze untouched with a triple. He's got the Quadra. He's looking for more. Can he get it out? Not going to be this time round. Will it force a flash? He's actually going to hop away. Freeze ends up. Managed to win the team fight. Everyone's right. rejoined back at Baron. 
Copenhagen Wolves hit a six minute pause button, but Pepe Nero has got a lot of poke from far. The Barrett's going down, but it's secured by the Copenhagen Wolves at what cost? Reduce the freeze. He's got himself Fantastic another kill for the Gnar. Throws everybody against the wall. I have the storms coming down and all of the poke damage from Pepe, but Audrey wants to clean up. Three members of the Copenhagen Wolves are down against three members of the Giants, and this has begun bloody. That is a, a triple kill reversed for AD carries and an ace against the Copenhagen Wolves. Very difficult position for the Copenhagen Wolves. We're going to most likely be one of the longer games we've seen in some. And Freeze takes a big hit from that Arcano Pulse. Let's see if uh, Soren can find an entry from the back line. Equalizer's available. Unlimited is going low. Can he get out the, the mine? No, he cannot because he's slam dunked down. Soren is going to get a massive knockback. It's followed by a massive gnaw in return. And everybody's flying everywhere. Gottfried is in retreat, but Audrey's going to get himself a kill onto Soren. They've traded some carries in the mid lane. Audrey's still left untouched. Can he survive with the Blade of the Ruined King and the Bloodthirster? He's self tank sustaining through everything. Got the Ren stacks piling up as he jumps onto Airwax. Rend is gonna be enough. Now he turns his attention to Young back. The Quadra kill comes in for Audrey, and the late game Callista dances around the wolves. You can kill Pepe Nero, but don't forget about Audrey. Remember that triple kill early in the game. He started snowballing, and he finally has four items, and he cleaned that up. That fight up, Steelback style. They're he up. was the janitor for Giants. Are they gonna end this game? It looks like it. There's a super minion in the base, but Audrey is tanking the Death Star laser. He managed just to survive and get rid of the aggro. 15 seconds before Freeze is up. This might be the game-winning push. Giants are onto the sexist second Nexus turret. They're onto the Nexus. What a tongue twister. And Audrey at 11, 3 and 8 is going to win the game for Giants. Yes, we be in. Right, I'm going to stop making predictions with Copenhagen Wolves.